Hello guys, welcome back to another unboxing and review video. Today I have the Can Collection Attago Heavy Armament version by Max Factory. The box looks pretty clean, really slick, and a really simple design. So a really nice looking box, but now let's get into the figure. Here's the base, it's the same as the Congo from Max Factory that I unboxed on this channel before. Same type of base, just a little bigger, because this figure is a lot bigger. Just a bunch of hexagons, it's supposed to give this effect of the sea and kind of pixelated, so really cool base. Now this is what the heavy armament version comes with, it's this huge belt that goes around, kind of like the rim of a warship. It has this, the light armament version does not have this, as detailed and as big, I, I believe it only has has a few small weapons you put around her but not this huge piece really nice detailed chains around the yankers on both sides you can move the torpedoes around a little bit they all have this kind of ball joint now Atago herself looks phenomenal fantastic max factory just really blows it out of the park with their figures everything about it is just perfect first off let's look at the face and her little sailor cap the sailor hat looks really good it's got this this kind of shaded blue on top and then the, the white outline on the rim and then we've got this pin on the hat looks really cool the eyes are really well done really shiny the nose and the mouth really awesomely sculpted you can see the teeth and also her tongue moving down to the dress it's got the dress is the same color as the sailor cap holy crap this is this just looks fantastic it's got this same blue color all around it really nice color I really like this color kind of like an ocean blue really fitting for the theme she has some ribbons tied all around her neck and coming up here it's got some buttons the dress has some folds all around here and a really awesome lines coming all over her dress really detailed of course she's wearing gloves really cool painting really cool paint job for the gloves as well and then on the other hand this hands closed and she's got one feet on the ground and the other just in the air given on her on her thighs you can see is some little planes so they're just nice little details that all, all over the figure that you can see also painted all around her stockings and her her shoes look fantastic as well kind of same blue for everything all around the blue on her shoes is kind of a little bit more shiny than the rest here's a nice comparison you can see it's a little bit kind of the same color but just shinier then coming around her back we have this little cloth thing with a nice pattern painted in there then this is where you're gonna put the heavy armament stuff for the hair you can see it's flowing pretty much all over the top half of the figure and it curls in the bottom it even curls around her body as well right here and right here the paint for the hair is not as good as the paint for the dress and the rest of the figure I'm not sure why it still looks good it doesn't look bad at all but it just looks a little bit more stale compared to the rest of the figure that has a lot more shading even on the inside of the whole outfit I really like the expression on her face really cute really cute expression now to put her on the base you just line this all up then push it in all the way so the heel of the shoe is touching the base as well there's also this little transparent stick you put on the base to hold her armament so you just stick it in the base on this peg right here attach this big part to the back then the back of Atago has this little hole where you're gonna lay the armament on it just gives it some nice support because over time if it didn't have that support it will probably lean over now fully assembled I got no complaints this figure is just perfect overall everything about it is just perfect Everything about the figure is just perfect. Let me know what you guys think of it. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.